Well, ladies and gentlemen, Jordan Peele has done it again. Just a few days ago, his new movie, Nope, hit theaters, and with how much I liked Get Out and Us, you know I made sure to be there day one. The film stars Daniel Kaluuya and Kiki Palmer as OJ and M. Haywood, a pair of siblings who inherit their late father's horse ranch after his untimely death, after which they are visited by what they believe to be an extraterrestrial entity. As usual, the casting is spot on as both lead actors have natural chemistry with one another that makes the sibling dynamic believable, and the relationship between the two is a focal point of the movie itself. One aspect of the movie that I'm still on the fence about is Steven Yeun's character Jupe. Despite the weird name, it's obvious that this character is meant to contrast the Haywood family, but personally, I feel like I couldn't interpret it fully on an initial viewing. If you've seen this film, I'd love to hear what you guys think in the comments. Naturally, the movie delivers in the scare department and then some, with the movie keeping you guessing as to what the Haywood family is truly dealing with up until the very end. The sound design contributes to both the atmosphere and storytelling in big ways. No high-pitched cheap trills here, instead making great use of sound distortion, and even more eerie, sometimes a total lack of sound. That said, the scariest part of the entire movie is the design and presence of the entity itself, hands down. Most of the movie has it shrouded in clouds, so there's an air of mystery as to what they're actually dealing with throughout the film, and what I absolutely love about this is that the movie never gives us any sort of answers. The obvious answer is to call it an alien and move on, but that feels like such an underwhelming description and doesn't capture what we're truly shown, as it almost feels angelic in a way. There's a sense of dreadful, Lovecraftian unease as the characters are constantly surveyed from a watchful eye in the sky, and the uneasiness only adds up as the movie goes on. This is easily one of the best extraterrestrial films I've seen, and could honestly be a companion piece to M. Night Shyamalan's Signs. I only have a few minor gripes with the movie, such as questionable character choices near the middle and end of the film, and the way that the entity is dealt with is a little contrived but those flaws can easily be overlooked to focus on the film's strengths. With this movie, Jordan Peele has without a doubt solidified himself as one of the great minds of modern day horror, and I cannot wait to see what he does next. If you haven't seen this movie, please do yourself a favor and go watch it immediately. It's a masterclass in horror and well worth the trip to the theater. In the meantime though, please be safe, be kind to one another, and keep enjoying horror. Until next time guys, bye.